as it does me, as it does any of us. But I tell you, it will be more tolerable for the land of Sodom on the day of judgment than for you. So years ago, the Lord said something to me. He said, Terry, if there are cities of refuge, there are cities of destruction, 12 of them in your nation. Gave the background of Matthew 11 so you can see that God, the Son of God himself, the Son of Man himself went there concerning certain towns and cities. So I've not done this in years. I did it early on, stupidly. <laughs> then people began to ask me about the cities and I shut up, was shut up by the Lord. I'm about to say them again. If I lived in the Miami area, I would get out. Get out. If I lived in New York City, I would get out. If I lived in Boston, Massachusetts, I would get out. If I, if I lived in Chicago, Illinois, I would get out. And if I lived in St. Louis, Missouri, I would get out. If I lived in Memphis, Tennessee, I would get out. If I lived in New Orleans, Louisiana, I would get out. If I lived in Madison, Wisconsin, I would get out. And if I lived in Seattle, Washington, I would get out. And if I lived in Portland, Oregon, I would get out. And if I lived in San Francisco, California, I would get out. And if I lived in Saint Los Angeles, California, I would get out. And if I lived, this is the 13th. If I lived in Washington, D.C., I would get out. That's 13. The last one, D.C., was added some years later. There are cities of judgment. Nashville, Tennessee is one of them. So is Atlanta, Georgia. And then there are cities of destruction. And there is a difference. And if you do not believe that the cities are going to come under that judgment, then read again Revelation 16. Please do not come to Van Leer. <laughs> Surely there's better places than here. 